What's going on guys? Welcome back to another episode of Far Cry 5. We're continuing exactly where we left off in yesterday's episode. So, what we're going to do today is we're actually going to go and hit up, a, well, a, like a main, kind of main mission. Let me just itch my nose. I've got a very, very itchy nose today. Um, but yeah, we have uh, more missions here. Um, let's just go do it. Um, I think we can just do it. So, let's go do it. Hopefully, when we travel on around and stuff like that, we'll find more missions like this. I actually didn't know you can get missions that way, but uh, now I know. Uh, the more we know. Uh, okay, we need a car. Or some sort of transportation. Wish we could just press up on the D-pad and call for a, a car. That or we're going to be running it for a while. Guy here. I think I might know where there might be a vehicle. Oh, no, that isn't a guy. There's a wolf. And he's just run off with our arrow. Oh, well, there's a car here. How's it going, buddy? Take these guys out. Easy peasy. Oh, there's another guy over here. Pick a room. Help me! Well, we're gonna take this. Hey, help me! Mate, you don't need no help. I'm sure Deputy Hudson's making John's life miserable. She's one tough lady. That she is. Praise the Lord. Thanks, Deputy. Right, we'll get in this car and we will drive now. First things first, we'll turn off that radio. Right, we should get there pretty quickly now. Nothing like driving the car to our destination, though. One thing I find stupid as well, like, uh, like you've got like the fog of war thing on the map. Um. And the only way to get rid of it is to be on the ground and, like, get it away that way. This guy here's got a mission for us. Excuse me, sir. And since she's got a mission for us, we'll talk to her. There's an old veteran who lives just over there. He can't move very well anymore. I hope he's not in any trouble. I'd feel much better if you looked in on him. I'm out of here! Alright. That's how we easily get new missions. New side quests as well. Side quests made missions. Doesn't really matter as long as we're getting missions to do. It's just worth stopping in here. Especially if there's only two guys there. I have to keep that in mind now. Okay. Some strange reason I really just want to get out of the car early. New character found. Uh, hello there, mate. Find someone who's interested in the truth. How's it going? Fellow seeker of justice. Yeah, I know who you are. You're that deputy that's been stirring the Peggy's globalist pot. Everything about this cult stinks, and you know I'm right. Say it. Say it at the same time as me. Go. We are slaves to the government. <laughs> Good enough. Mind control. That's right, partner. It's been their plan all along. You know it. I know. It. And you want to know how they're doing it? It's the food. Well, not anymore. You and me are gonna fuck the government <laughs> sideways. Name Zip Kupka. I'll explain on the way. Come on. Where are we going? Get in. I'll drive. Oh, great. All right, please, no music. World 
it's not We've got music. To an end, like the cult I think. says. That's a demonically driven government ploy of a scare tactic to pull our attention away from what's really happening. This place is ground zero for government fuckers, baby fuckers, chemtrails, wither manipulation, pesticides, genetically modified this, that, and the other. I did some digging around the stockyard of the place and found barrels full of that brain melting stuff. You know what I'm talking about. Bliss. They're feeding it to the animals and we're eating. Chemicals of conformity. And what we need to do is destroy the tools that are indoctrinating us. Alright, so it sounds like we're going to have to destroy some bliss. Because they're feeding it to the animals. Like the really like the music, but uh, it's gonna get me copyright Dogs struck in it. more loyal than people, smarter too. And by we, I mean you. <laughs> I ain't got a bond with those animals. I can't bring myself to put them down. That's right, deputy. I'm talking euthanization. It's the only way. Make sure you get them all. Just blowing them up, count. <laughs> Because I've got some uh, very nice uh, grenades over here, I think. Uh, where are my grenades? There we are, we've got grenades. There they are, Kip. Oh, sweet little angels. It's for the best. Alright. Going guns blazing. Mike was out of ammo. Okay, he just blew up. Where's he gone? Well, I would if I could bloody see him. Use grenades, it's easier. Did you get them all? Nope. Still see some. Boomer's got him. Who a bear? Come on, dude, die already. Grab some ammo. I think we're starting to run a little bit low on ammo again. How's it going? Talk to you in a second. I'm gonna booby trap the place. Their reinforcements will be met with the fire of God. All right, they're getting reinforcements. Anyway, let's take out that while we're here. Any demons come back here? They'll fall sky high. What are we doing now? <laughs> Here they come. Wait. What? No. No! They're bringing in cows! Ryan? Davy? Gina? No! Turn back cows! Don't come in here! This cows are gonna go. Find some cover. Let's reload. Boom. 
Puma? Where you at, buddy? Puma? Oh, please don't say Puma just died. Anyway, there we go. Mission complete. I think Boomer died during that. We'll have a look now. Right. Um. Another mission. another mission anyway um i just want to have a look at the map here quickly uh see where missions are at uh, okay and then plus i want to see how far we are through this we're actually we're getting there it's taking a while for us to get there but we're getting there right let's start up the next mission with this guy we might as well now it's personal you know what we're gonna do what we're gonna hit him where it hurts. Atonement is the final step before fully accepting the word of the Father into your heart. Our sins, having been finally exposed, can now be removed, freeing our souls and opening our hearts. Now the pain of atonement is measured by the severity of the sin, and thanks to your deputy, the sins of this resistance are indeed severe. You will all atone for what the deputy has done. You will all welcome the word of the Father into your hearts. You will all say yes. You sinner! Jesus Christ, where's this guy die at? There he is. Pray for me. Nope, nobody's gonna pray for you, buddy. That's what we need to do. We need one of these. Let's just heal up here quick. see that. Right, I'm pretty sure we just did whatever we had to do here, I think. Right, what I am going to do is I am actually going to... Okay, I can't drive that. Right, let's just loot everybody here. We're running really low on ammo. I don't know if I have to blow up these cars or not. That is... 
I know we were supposed to do something with those, and I'm, I'm just guessing take them out. Just to make sure. I will place that on that. We'll head over here. And... That'll do it. I don't know if that... Let's have a look at the missions. Okay, no. Right, I'm pretty sure we've just done one of two, maybe. I'm not sure. So I'm only seeing one more of those on the map now. There's another convoy there. So I wonder if... I don't know if we just took one out or not. I'm not sure. Right, let's just get on with the main, uh, this mission over here. See what he's got for us. Why must the cost for liberty be... They know how to cut me deep. But I know how to bleed them dry. You know what we're gonna do? We're gonna hit him where it hurts. Are we? Now we're talking. The poor animals that died here today paid the ultimate price for our liberty. They are heroes and patriots. We will honor their sacrifice because history tells us that every great victory begins with tragedy. That's right. It's time to hit pay dirt. And where's that, you wonder? The old gold mine. That's where the government's getting the funding for this whole operation. <laughs> yeah! You thought it was closed. <laughs> That's what the government told us. Who the fuck trusts the government? I'm telling you, it's all connected. They're sitting on ten times Fort Knox down there. We're gonna bring this whole globalist empire down and give America back to the people. Those demons are always talking about a collapse. Let's give them one. Take these thermite charges. They have the same specs as the ones that brought down Tower 7. Stick them on all the gold you see. Kick the tires and fight the liars, baby! Woo! <laughs> what? You waiting for me? <laughs> uh, hell, I'm retiring. You saw what just happened. That shit was real fucked up. <laughs> All right. Cow survived, though. A couple of cows survived. At least three. All right, we're heading over there. Right, so what we'll do is we'll just take this uh, vehicle over here. It's got a gun on it. This gun's always come in handy. Let's go. And we'll also put a waypoint on. Plus, uh, I need to reactivate Boomer. I think he died. Oh, it's going to take him seven minutes to respawn. Good damn it. Alright, that's alright. We'll have him back by uh, next episode. Yeah, we should have him back by next episode. Oh. What happened to the car? Got stuck on something, I think. Yeah, Boomer will be back definitely by... Uh, by next episode. I'll make sure I activate him between uh, episodes as well. So once he dies, he takes a while to respawn, I guess. It's probably something like 10 minutes for him to respawn, which kind of sucks. It's not such a bad thing if, uh, if, you're, not, uh, if you're not playing this and recording it at the same time, I guess. But uh, if you want to record it, then god damn it. Gotta wait seven minutes, and I'm not gonna sit around for seven minutes babbling on while we wait for Puma to respawn. Okay, we're here. Alright, we're gonna have to do this the old fashioned way without Boomer. Rig. Rig four gold crates with explosives. Alright. Through the stealthy. Miss Boomer already. Let's get the high ground, I think. High ground is always the best ground. Grab that make kit. 
Let's do my kids here. We can't grab either of them. Get moving. This here's quiet. Same as before. You down. Doing it all quiet like. Bees. Ammo. Just what we need. Jesus Christ. These guys don't know where we are, so... Makes my job a bit easier. Shot missed. Oh, you know what? Good night. Come on. That works. That works too. <laughs> right, let's come back up here. Now, where was that ammo at? Is it up here? Was. Oh, we emptied it. Thought we didn't, but oh well. Uh, right here. Okay, yeah, there we go. All done. Deputy, it's Zip. A truck carrying a bunch of stuff hey. just drove right by me. They're heading your way. Don't let them disarm the charges. They're on a relay, so all of them gotta be armed to work. So where do we park our car? Heads up, we got live balls in here. Spread out and defuse them before this whole place blows. Hurry! Here they come. Seriously, there's a pig in alarm? No way. Get out my face. Easy enough. Use a med kit quickly. Oh. Oh wow. <laughs> well, hopefully, if it respawns us, I'm gonna I'm gonna immediately turn around and try and find that alarm. Cause that alarm's gonna be very annoying at some well if we don't take it out straight away it's gonna be very annoying. Cause uh, I think it calls in helicopters immediately, I think. 
Right, let's go. Let's, uh, let's find that alarm. A truck carrying a bunch of demons just drove right by me. They're heading your way. Don't let them disarm the charges. They're on a relay, so all of them gotta be armed to work. No, don't see it. Heads up, we got live bombs in here. I don't see it. Where is it? This whole place blows. Hurry. God, we're almost dead already. Stick in my kit then. Right. Don't have a clue where that sniper is, but whatever. Let's just get out of here. I don't have a clue where that alarm is. I did just look around and I didn't see it. And it, I, like, like usually it's like a tower with like a uh, like with a either a red or green flashing beacon on top. I don't see no red or green flashing beacon. Let's have a look to see if Boomer's available. Because Boomer might be available, and if he, if he's available, he will definitely come in handy. Wrong button. Um, are you available, Boomer? Another minute. Ah, God damn it. Minute and a half. Deputy, it's Zip. A truck carrying a bunch of demons just drove right by oh, me. Don't see They're it. heading your way. Don't let them disarm the charges. They're on a relay, so all of them gotta be armed to work. <laughs> Heads up, we got live bombs in here. Spread out and defuse them before this whole place blows. Guess the best thing Hurry. to do is maybe stay on the roof and shoot them down from the top. I saw somebody. in the full magnelli. Here's what I think it is. It is. Hell yeah. Just what I wanted. We're gonna have to buy some ammo at the end of this. Guys here. I'm coming over here for the med kits because I remember med kits being over here. Get behind us. Back this way. Jesus, how many of them are there? Let's just use my kit. Helps a bit. <laughs> Good night, buddy. Let's get down that. Nope. 
Oh, almost fell off. Get off my bombs. And I think we need to get out of here because there's only 30 seconds left. Let's just try to avoid dying. If we can, that is. Okay, we're good. Five seconds. Two, one. The bombs are armed. Now tighten your butthole and start running. It's about to snow. Go play. Oh shit. It's too late. Run, run. I think you're in the clear. It's too late. Run. Now tighten your butthole and bear witness to the sights and sounds of true unadulterated justice. <laughs> Hell yeah. You're a goddamn American hero. The global elitist strategy is ruined. The war for our minds has been won. Joseph and his demons have been smacked in the mouth by red blooded American true grit warriors. This is what we look like. This is what we act like. <laughs> we are pioneers and we are here to stay. All right. <laughs> Kill this guy. Right, so one thing we really do need, because we used up pretty much all of our ammo this uh, entire mission here, is we need to go get some more ammo eventually. So, um, let's have a look at the map here quickly. I just want to go see what we might do in the next one. Right, we can now get Boomer again, so let's uh, reselect Boomer. And let's uh, have a look at the map and see where we can go. I think what we'll do is we'll come here next episode, do a couple of side quests... Uh, and I think we'll probably call it a week, and then next week we'll probably uh, head off over here by in Fifth's territory again. Uh, find some missions and stuff like that. What I might do is, uh, in between this week and next week, I might go around and find some more missions and everything. Um, and if anything interesting pops up or anything, I will record as I get them. Um, but uh, if anything interesting comes up, I'll put it in uh, next week's episode anyway. Uh, the first episode of next week. But I won't be doing that until after next episode anyway. So anyway, what I'm going to do guys. Is I'm actually going to end this one here. Hope you guys have enjoyed. If you have, hit that like button. If you didn't, the like button's always right next door. If you haven't it's, yeah. if you haven't hit subscribe already, hit subscribe. It always helps the channel out. It helps the channel grow. All that fun stuff. And boom is back. And I will see you guys in the next one.